if you are the one who struggles a lot in life about finding that stability in fact you feel like struggle in your life has become synonymous you resolve one issue and there pops up the other one well here are three tips and i would say if you are making these mistakes watch it and try to improve so you improve your life stay with me Hi everyone this is Jaya Karam Chandani welcome to Invincible Passion Talk Show where every week we share here some thoughts and insights and suggestions for you to have a balanced life before i share further quickly hit the subscribe button so you get the notifications when new episodes are out today is all about don't make these three mistakes in your life especially after sunset the very first one if you are the one who knocks your friends and neighbors doors asking can i have a cup of milk or can i have a bowl of sugar or a teaspoon of salt now salt and sugar helps you enjoy your meal these are the basic ingredients in your cooking and milk of course this sign of abundance as well fulfillment of wishes and desires and just like the sun the rising sun has all the power and potency to do the job the sun is supposed to do sunset is the time for sun to set just like when someone is in power people hover around that powerful personality because they expect they'll get some favors or being associated with a powerful person you may gain some power too but nobody calls a person who has no power just like the sun sets so after sunset that is another sign in your life it's time to now just watch around if you give away your basic ingredients salt and sugar and milk then you will face struggles in your life you feel like the struggles are never disappearing one way or the other you are struggling whether it's your neighbor or your friend and in fact on the other side if you are the one who has this habit of going to people's home or neighbors or friends and asking for a cup of milk or some sugar or salt these are basic ingredients think of if you asking from others whether before sunset or after sunset that shows lack and dependency on others you have to realize if you are dependent for your basic necessities on others it's not going anywhere so you have to stop start focusing on what is that one thing you can stop so you are self sufficient So either way if you are giving to someone after sunset then you are literally taking away from your life your savings and symbols of abundance the basic necessity that means you have pulled from your basic necessities to give away and that too after sunset means when there is the need the sun is no longer in power that means things are changing and if you're the one who borrows either way it's not good secondly If you're the one who comes from work in the evening, opens the house door or brings the car keys and just throws everywhere, instead of throwing everywhere, find a dedicated space, hang the keys. Keys are just think of a tool for you to have access to your luxuries or comforts like your house, like access to opportunities, your car. So if you are putting them anywhere and everywhere, then what happens opportunities are not coming to you fully cooked they are dispersed and they will make you run around and chase them just like you're looking for your keys rather than having it in a place when you hang it is starts to activate the plan the area where you are presented with multiple opportunities and you decide which one is the right one you rather be in that place versus running around So be careful when you throw your keys everywhere in your looking find a dedicated space. And here's the third one which I have seen is going to absolutely make changes in your life. Your wallet. You come from work and guys especially you you come from work and you throw your wallet anywhere just keep it on the kitchen counter or the bedside or in your closet and you are looking where is my wallet? What does wallet symbolize? Your credit cards, your cash, your government issued ID. 
so your backing and support you cannot step out without a driving license or that id so if you put your wallet everywhere and then you are looking for it what it symbolizes is you have to really walk around you have to really beg and go after people to get your things done you're not finding the support but says you are chasing people and it's really giving you hard time because you're looking for your wallet the your support structure is missing additionally if you can just find a dedicated space and not keep the wallet in front of everyone to see versus in a drawer and just remember which drawer what it happens is you are in a very commanding position you know what you need the government support or the cash or the flexibility you have and you know where it is and you can use versus looking and getting running around after people getting some consent or their support or decision help very very important don't let around your wallet go everywhere find a dedicated space and if you can keep in a drawer so not it's not out there for public eyes just like your precious things if you take care of it take care of your wallet these tips are absolutely amazing and if you feel in your life you have constant struggles make these few changes and let me know what you observed but don't forget to share this with your friends and family and i'll see you soon